going on everybody it's luke or luke at you and i'm here bringing you how to bees basically everything about bees i know this is a little bit old but i ran into a lot of problems because i looked up on youtube many different types of videos and the last video that i finally watched gave me the answer that i needed so i went through like probably at least an hour of videos wasting time on stuff i did not need to do and now i figured out what you the easiest the easiest way to make a bee farm very quickly if you want a bee farm i did i've never really played minecraft before to this extent i haven't played since oh my goodness since there was like 40 achievements for xbox 360 so basically all of this, all you see right here, all this right here, and these two right here, and wherever the bees are, they're probably doing their own thing. I did maybe like 10, 15 minutes. Once I got the first step done, 10, 15 minutes. What's the first step? Okay, so you do not have to look around for these bee nests. You do not need to do that. They spawn in plains biomes, forest biomes, uh, flower forest biomes. You don't need to look for them. All you have to do is place down a flower. Any type of flower. Well, not any type. Not the two block tall flowers. Don't do those ones. Do these one by one blocks. The red, the yellow, the blue, the white. Any of those, those work. Place it right like one block away. See, this is one block distance. Right there on the second block, you place down the flower. And then you place down a sapling. And that tree, that sapling that will grow into a tree, has a 2% chance to spawn with a bee's nest. Once I got that bee's nest, all you got to do, put down a campfire. You don't know how to make a campfire. Basically, all, honestly, everything's so simple. It's so simple. All it is is some coal, some sticks, and some oak logs right here. This is the crafting recipe. Some oak logs, some sticks, and some coal. You can use charcoal as well if you want to, but, you know, charcoal is a lot harder to get anyway. Coal is super easy to get, so I would expect you to use coal. Just to be safe, I would put trap doors around the campfires that need to be placed right underneath the bees nest if you don't know these shears that i have these let's see let's use it on one that's overflowing so this beehive you make beehives after you collect honey so normally you would use shears and you collect honey like that from bee nests but these two are not uh complete levels yet this one's honey level four if you see in the right hand corner um the fourth line from the bottom it says honey level four if you press f3 if you're playing on pc this will let you know when your hives or your nests are eligible for being able to take honey out of them this one's only level three so once you figure that and you wait and you, they get honey all it really is is breeding bees at a very and these things breed fast like i don't know the exact time and distance it is between each time they can breed again but it's not that long i i would say it's like a minute tops because i bred two bees and then they were able to breed again in like a minute so i would say pretty fast and that's really all it is is just breeding bee bees you can breed them with any type of flower you know see because they come around they're attracted to bees they're attracted to flowers so they'll come around just like this you get two bees you right click right click and they'll do their you know their thing and you get a little xp point and a little baby bee and that little baby bee will continue to produce honey for whatever hive or nest it chooses and as you can see here, this one hasn't been used yet, but I put this one down, and look, these two right here are already level 5. Now, if you don't know how to make these hives, which basically all hives are, is it's just another nest, except you know you can move it around, you can break it and move it around. Don't break it once bees go in it, though, because those bees will get angry with you, just like... Even if there's a campfire under it, if you break this hive while bees are um, in it or they have 
I guess, claimed it, they will get mad at you. So don't break them. Make sure you place it where you want it to be. Get it? Where you want it to be? Wow. Okay, anyway. You want to know how to make those beehives. Very simple. All it is is three honeycombs and then six oak planks, you know, three on the top, three on the bottom, as you can see. And each time you use shears on any nest or hive, you will get three honeycombs each time. So once it gets to honey level five, and you can do that for your first time, you instantly can make another home for more bees. I would continue to breed bees as fast as possible, even if you can't keep up with homes. The more bees, the better. You don't have to go ridiculous with it. But I would make quite a bit of bees if you really want to bee farm to grow quickly. Because the more bees, the faster the honey levels will go up. The faster the honey levels go up, the faster you'll be able to make more beehives. That's my take. Let me know if you need any other guidance. I'll answer comments basically as fast as I can. I thank you all for the time that you put into my videos. I appreciate the support so much. I am so thankful for anyone that spends any time of their day to watch something that I create. So I thank you from the bottom of my heart, and I shall see y'all in the next i guess episode i don't do how to's too much i haven't i don't think i actually no i do do guides for minecraft dungeons so if you need some guides for minecraft dungeons look at those i got some secret level tips on there too so i appreciate all the support once again yada 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 thank you thank you subscribe like if you want and i'll see y'all in the next one peace out